for now, let's go straight to the police. And um, the, the police have put out a statement about the Easter holidays uh, where they'll be enhancing security. Now, the, the, the Christendom, the statement says, will celebrate Easter festivities from Friday 2nd, April 2021 by Monday 5th April to Monday 5th April 2021 across the world. In Ghana, this will be characterized by religious activities and amusement events. Now, it says here, the police service first mandates will provide enhanced security during the period. Therefore, appeals to the general public to abide by the COVID-19 restrictions imposed by the president with legal backing of the Parliament of Ghana, as the police will strictly enforce same. It first begins with religious activities. It says churches, mosques, and religious bodies are expected to hold services not beyond two hours for 100 participants maximum only, observing all other COVID-19 protocols. Conventions, crusades, pilgrimages, and such large physical gatherings are not allowed. Also, it says carnivals, festivals, beach and amusement events. The hosting of any carnival, festival, beach gathering, street dance, procession, parades, and such events will be illegal. Nightclubs are banned from opening, as well as cinemas and movie houses. All activities of closed room bars or pubs including those in hotels, remain illegal. However, open-air drinking spots may, pro may operate, provided that they op observe all other COVID-19 protocols. Um, now, operators of tourist sites and attractions may open to the public, provided they ensure the wearing of face masks, social distancing, and enhanced hygiene by all patrons. It also says families may like to take advantage of the holiday period to bury loved ones. The public is reminded it is illegal to hold funerals. Private burials may be held with a maximum of 25 people if held outside the church or religious facility. For church or religious burial services, the maximum number of participants should be 100. Now, in all cases, the COVID-19 protocols are expected to be observed and the duration shall be two hours maximum. Together with road safety partners, police officers would be present at mapped out traffic congestion and accident prone areas. There's a there's a road safety um, advice there as well. 